All right, guys, so welcome back. Uh, I hope you guys are ready for some more exciting KOF matches coming up. Uh, I think we have EG Justin Wong versus Arcade Shock Renault coming up. Okay. So our, our, um, it looks like we're going to go right into the match. If we're going to... Okay, no, we're not going right into the match. Let's talk really quick about that last match because I really want to point a few things out there. Okay, yeah, mm, feel free. In my opinion, the better player in that match was Mr. KOF. By far. Somehow, Bala stumbled and managed to win those matches. Uh, but honestly, Mr. KOF was a better player in that match. Okay. Yes. Sir. What do you think, Ryan? Um, I would say that's pretty accurate. Okay. All right. And well, it looks uh, like, yeah, we're, we're starting there. EG Justin Wong versus Arcade Shock Reynolds. I have no idea who's going to win this, by the way. <laughs> I really don't. Um, I think they've played before, and Reynolds took this match very convincingly. So, uh, I would not be surprised if uh, Reynolds takes this. And he's just getting right in there. Kim going for those resets. Stand B, 4B. Stand B. Stand B. Nice. Dude, that recovery is so nice. That oh, he got him. He was one inch off the ground. He still managed to hit him there. Not Seemed bad. Like the last possible moment he could have hit that. Yeah, that's the very last moment. Then. Well, okay. So, Rel takes the first round. Yeah. Okay. So, we have King coming in for Justin Wong on the left. Okay. Nice way to start the match. There we go. That reset is nasty because you don't know if he's going to cross you up or he's going to stay in front of you. Yeah, any character like that, they can just change the jump trajectory with a special move. Right. Oh, he uh, here we go. And Reynolds takes round two. Okay. All right, so Reno getting in there. He's gonna try to wrap it up here. See if he gets that uh, HD combo in the corner. He can might as well take this match right here. Stand B, stand B. Nice. See, uh, Justin Wong knows what to do. But I don't think he's fast enough to react to everything that's happening then. Beautiful! Off the counter. Yeah, if anything, Justin just doesn't have enough experience with the game just yet. He's still, of course, very good at King of Fighters 15. Yeah, he, it looks like he does know about the basics, the fundamentals. He needs to get right into the, the nitty greedy of the game. Oh. Beautiful there. And there we go. EX Axe Kick. Yeah, EX Axe Kick to finish the match. Yeah, and whoever uh, loses this set is going to go to, uh, is going to be out of there with a tie for seventh place finish. They're going to go home with, I believe, like 550. Not bad. Yeah, so not bad at all. Okay. So Justin Wong placing top eight and getting hey, paid. Maybe not just top eight, maybe higher than that, okay? You never know. Or maybe an upset can be coming up. <sighs> all right, so. Well, we I guess now is the point where we see if Justin is going to stick with his characters or not. But I don't think he knows how to use anyone else. I think it's just going to be a rematch. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. I think those are the only three characters that uh, Justin Wong knows how to use. So uh, I'm pretty sure he's gonna stick with those. Now he was telling me that he wants to use Yuri when he comes back. Okay. When he goes okay. back home. 